Animals, stop! Back off! Take what you... You've been warned! You asked for it! What happened? They demanded we give our entire yield to the Crown. Warren refused. They killed our animals, salted our earth, then dragged us out. You saw what followed. I'm afraid we have nothing to give you in thanks, stranger. We have nothing left. Perhaps there is something you could do instead. Anything. I live in a small community not far from here. The soil is rich. The people I live with would have need of fresh vegetables, wheat, or corn. If you were to rebuild your farm, you may prosper. What kindness is this? You'll certainly come see. Thank you. Thank God you are here. Prudence is missing. She went out to gather some things this morning and never returned. I'm worried sick. What if she's hurt? I will find her. The dog might help track her down. He has a good nose. Come on, boy! She has been gathering the evening primrose almost every night. She is obsessed with the oil it yields. That is all going to stop now. I don't understand why she wants so damn much of the stuff. She picked some here. She can't be far. We should split up to cover more ground. Thank you so much, Connor. Thank you. 
I don't want to think what might have happened if you had not arrived. I saw some primrose growing Fire. there, and the bear just came charging at me. Why are you gathering primrose? Well, Warren and I have been trying to conceive a child for a long time now. I read that evening primrose Fire. encourages fertility. I'm sorry, this is not a proper conversation given the circumstance. I understand. Not another word on the matter. Prudence! Are you all right, my love? I'll be fine. Thanks to Connor. Thank you, Connor. Once again. You want to tell him, my love? I'm pregnant. Congratulations. It's been a long time coming. It does present a slight problem, however. There's no doctor for miles. Well, then we should find one. I know of one that may consider moving here. His name is Dr. Lyle White. It's been a turn since we last saw him, but you might try his old house in Boston. Dr. White? No. He's the drunken sotter on the corner. If you can get his attention, tell him I quit. All this ire on him. Not worth getting caught up in it. I have a family. Dr. White. Yes? My name is Connor. And what can I help you with? Another quote for the broadsheets for you to twist against me? I'm here to make you an offer. Don't you know who I am? I'm the doctor the British have been slandering all over town. White death. No? I was given your name by my friends Warren and Prudence. Prudence is with child and requires a doctor's hand. Prudence is pregnant? Ha! They've been trying for years, it seems. Maybe getting away from Boston is exactly what I need. What is it, Prudence? I feel silly bothering you with this, but Warren's taken a yield to market in Boston. Could you round up the livestock for me? I've tried, but this baby in my belly takes the wind out of me. Of course. I will see to it. Hip! Hip! This way! Not there.
faster than they look. Thank you, Kona. I could never have managed that. <laughs> it was my pleasure. Are you well? I am. And I couldn't be happier. Warren and I have been waiting a long time for this. And if truth be told, we could not dream of a better place to raise our family. <laughs> 